you phoned yet? The Scotty McClue Late Night Phone-In from... C- You're listening to Scotty McClue's Mega Phone-In. We are, of course, live on City Radio. That's the big one. That's the important one. The UK's number one. And the time is 17 minutes to 11 o'clock. Back to the telephones. Very, very busy tonight. Are you there, Thomas? Hello, Scotty. How are you doing, sir? How are you doing? I'm all right. Good. Oh, well, Scotty, I was bullied when I was at school. Yeah? And, Scotty, it was the most miserable time of my life. I really... Unbelievable it was, Scotty. Unbelievable. Why do you think you were bullied, Thomas? Because, Scotty, I didn't get to fit in with the gang. You know what I mean, Scotty? I was fat and, of course, the stuttering, as you know. Yeah. But why Why should everybody fit in with the gang? I mean, what's happened to live and let live? It's not like that no more, Scotty, at school now. It's... You're either in the gang or you're not. That's the way it is, Scotty, at school. Yeah, well, I think we have to cater for all sorts. Yeah, same as Scotty, I was spat at. I mean, I was called names. I've had my coat ripped. I mean, I was beaten up outside of school. And, Scotty, I'll tell you something, it was terrible. It was really terrible. I really... I felt so awful when I came home from school that I didn't want to go back again. Do you not think that uh, it's a lack of experience? I mean, what, what, what age are you, Thomas? I'm now nearly 17. Do you not think it's a lack of experience in people that they don't understand it? See, if you think about it, mm. uh, you know, I mean, this is an age-old thing. It's not happened just with you, but if somebody yeah. is different, if somebody um, stutters or whatever, mm-hmm. then... You know, really, as a society, we want to be ensuring that we're helping them, that we're minimising, you know, their difficulty. Yeah, well, Scotty, my mum went up to the school about, what, ten times at least. Yeah. And I mean, she told the teachers, and Scotty, they never done a single thing. And I mean, I had to leave that school in the end. Yeah, sometimes I wonder how switched on teachers actually are. They're not, you know, they're not at all. Do you know, I mean, I taught in various schools myself. Yeah. Some teachers were brilliant, some staff rooms were brilliant, but you came across the odd loony mm. uh, who was just a, a, a troublemaker in a staff room, you know? Yeah. Yeah, well, Scotty, now, you know what? I've left school now, Scotty, and I haven't got one friend in the world. Yes, you have. Yeah, Scotty, you, of course. Scotty McClure. Of course. You've got mates, yeah. and I've got thousands of mates, so you can, you can have them. Well, Scotty, you know what? And then apart from you, I haven't got a single friend in the world, Scotty. Well, and that is awful for the net. And I'm a teenager to say, Scotty. Well, there's your mum, for a start. Oh, yeah, there's me mum, yeah. There's me. Yeah. I can get you another 15 million mates. <laughs> right? So that's you. You've got 15 million and one. <laughs> right? Yeah. So you're certainly not on your own, old chum. Aye. There's no problem at all. And we're only at the end of the phone. I know, Scotty, that's right. If you ever get a problem, you lift the phone. I will, Scotty. Yes. I will. I will. Well, uh, you know, we'll sort it out for you. Hello, anyway, Scotty. You are my my mate, Scotty. And no. I mean that. You are. No problem. Well, I mean it as well, mate. Yeah. You know, I am. If I ever meet you, I'll shake you by the hand. I hope I get to meet you one day, Scotty. Hey, well, it would be a privilege for I, me as well. How you come to Prescott? And no probs. I know Prescott well. <laughs> Yes. Okay, thanks, Scotty. I'll tell you, I've been flung out of better places. <laughs> <laughs> you take care of yourself, I mate. Do. All right, and have a wonderful Christmas. And don't worry about that because listen, listen, you're a man with a terrific personality. I wouldn't be surprised if you're extremely gifted. Yeah. And extremely clever. And I want you to go right to the top. Never mind these people. They can't lace your boots. Okay, okay, thanks, Scotty. Have you got that? I, I have, yeah. someday they will be very sorry that they didn't tap into your potential. Yeah. So don't you worry about that, right? If people didn't understand you, mm. that's not your problem, that's theirs. That's right, Scotty. They're the ones with the problem, not you, old son. No, I know. So I'm just going to, I'm shaking you by the hand here. Yeah, I don't know shaking you as well scotty okay buddy and you take great care of yourself i mean you have a happy new year top man okay scotty. And i'll speak to you soon bye-bye hey see you tom bye-bye bye-bye Ta-da, mocha. there we are what a nice lad now uh warren from salford are you there warren i'm there scotty how are you mate i'm all right mate how are you okay mocha i'll tell you right i'm a bit i'm a bit on the cold side in here a bit on i'm sitting here with a far coat on the I'm sitting here with a fur coat and no knickers. Right, well, first of all, before we start... Go on. I apologise for last time. 
I want to... I got cut off, didn't I? You did want to. You got chopped off. You know what happened? What happened, like? Yeah. You, had, you hadn't paid your bill. No, no, no. I'm on a pay as you go. All right. I just put me a £10 credit card. I've just used £10 waiting to talk to you. You're me. on a pay as you go and you went before you paid. Right, well, now <laughs> I've just took my credit card again, so we're talking on my money. Let's talk. Well, you need to be on a pay as you stay. <laughs> <laughs> Right then, I was trying to get a rapid last time. Go on, lad. It's happened again, on it? We're talking about depression again sort of thing, aren't we? No, no, we're just mentioning it. Don't get us all into depression for that. Oh, no, no, Scotty, that's not my game, is it? <laughs> right, I... now then. Go on. Right, I've grown up in sofas all my life, yeah? No problem, brilliant. Right, I've seen all this violence, all the things you're talking about. Yep. Now then, it's not the kids. Go on, tell me it's... more. Right, it's the parents. Right. Right, the parents are not teaching them right from the bud. So you and I were brought up in the same type of place, really? Well, that's why I talked to you, Scotty, because I know you're you with the program. Yeah. Right, now then, if these parents teach them from the bud, no matter how much money they've got. Right. Right, at the moment, I've got a lot of money, I've got a good job. Good man. Right. My kids are getting the best. You can take me on if I get sacked then. <laughs> hey, Scott, you've you, you, you gone up in the world. Aye. Like, like the last station you were on before this one. <laughs> Quite right. Right, now this station you're on now is bigger, yeah? Massive. Right, well, I think you're the next Springer, yeah? A next Springer? No, the next Springer. Oh, the next Springer? Right, you're... Do you, you mean a Springer? Oh. Hey, mate, I've done it again, sorry, don't come You did it, you said the F, stop it! Coming on here and effing and jeffing, you're not at home now, you know. I won't do it again. <laughs> <laughs> right then. You're not at your auntie's now, you know. I think you're going national. I think you're going on TV. I might do. You might do. You speak, <laughs> how many are we speaking to now? If the letter's on. No, and what I'm trying to say is, how many listeners have we got listening now? Anything up to 15 million. Right, if you get on the box, how many how many watches have we got? How many watches in the whole of the country? No, the world. 60 million. Right, well that's and where you're going, that's what I think. 60 million in this country. Right, your bank balance is going right through the roof bigger than a skyscraper, mate. Hey, I'll, I'll see that when it happens. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope. <laughs> I hope it happens before it's nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's said all my life, do you know, I'll tell you this, Scotty, someday you're going to be famous. I say, well, you better flame and hurry up. Right, right, right. How long have we got? I've got nose. Here we go, then. Hopefully till the end of the programme. What I reckon is, it doesn't really matter how much money you've got. Doesn't, actually. Right. What I think matters is, it's all about respect, honesty, and... Basically, showing them the right from wrong. Yeah. Look a little bit at the Bible. The Bible, people might think that's just a piece of paper that's just wrote on. But if you look into it a lot, like I have myself... You say, you, save yourself a lot of bother in the long run, don't you? If you read between the lines, because that's where you've got to read, I think that is, that is right. Now that... All these Ten Commandments and all this lot. I'll tell you, if you read Leviticus, it even tells you what happens when you're out your, your head and drink. Right. Hold on. I'm out my head on drink. No, I'm not saying you are. I'm saying, oh, if you, right. I'm saying if one reads Leviticus. When I said you, I meant you as a person, as one of the population. Oh, on. Can I just mention one thing? Yeah. I love saying it. Did you do? Yeah. <laughs> what did you say? Dinky do is a moose loose about this hoose. You I love, I love, I love yeah, that bit. I bet you sing along to that. <laughs> hey, you're a top man, I'll tell you. Hey, you're a top man as well, mate. That's why I'm using twenty pounds, twenty pounds to talk to you. Well, I've been told you're talking about McClue going on the telly. I've been told I'm way ahead of me time. <laughs> one thing. Yeah. Where's your, where's your mix? Where's me what? It's got in the clue mix. Oh, the Mega Mix. Yeah, the I've got mega it. Mix. I'll give it a play for you after the living. Right, after. What time is closing? Is it two again? I'll give you at uh, five past eleven. Is it closing at five past eleven? I'll, I'll play the Mega Mix for you. Right, right.
can I say dinky do to the nation it too? You can say dinky do to the world, la, because you're the top man. That is so. So what time shall I ring you back so I can say dinky do to the nation? Anybody that's anybody that's brought up in Salford, born and bred, they've got oh. my vote. Right, well, you've got my vote. How's your dog, mate? Because that means that you've got you've had a balance. What I call a balance stop bringing. I've had a balance stop bringing. Yeah, I've seen the poor, I've seen the rich. I'm in between, mate. Absolutely. You stay, you stay there. Don't go over the top because uh, you know the balance is is what it's all about. Well, well, honest, lad. Yeah. Being being talking all honesty, yeah. Uh, go on, lad. The last couple of weeks, I have been going a little bit over the top, as you might be able to tell by my voice. Yeah, don't go too over the top, lad, because uh, you're a top man. Right, I'm not, I know, I've got it all sorted, I'm not going over the top. No, don't go over the top, lad. And I'll tell you, get a pay as you stay, not a pay as you go. <laughs> <laughs> the problem is, I live, I live in Salford, and I can get the pay as you stay as cheap as just as you can get the pay as you go. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you, lad. How you going? Hey, I'm going to wash, I'm going to wash and dash. Right, can I ring you back and say goodbye to the nation later? Say goodbye to the nation now, if you like. Right, I'll say dinky do to the nation. Say dinky do, and I'll say goodbye to them later, la. Right, dinky do, Salford Power, let's teach our children right. Let's stop smashing people's windows, blowing up people's cars, and nicking people's money while they're at the lights. Dinky do, la. Dinky do, la. See you, la. See you again, Scotty. Ta-da, la. Ta-da. Top man.